starting at verse 2. Grace unto you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. We are bound to thank God always for you. Brethren, as it is meet, because that your faith groweth exceedingly, and the charity of every one of you all towards each other aboundeth. So that we ourselves glory in you in the churches of God for your patience and faith in all your persecutions and tribulations that ye endure, which is a manifest token of the righteous yeah. judgment of God, that ye may be counted worthy of the kingdom of God, for which ye also suffer, seeing it is a righteous thing with God to recompense tribulation to them that trouble you. And to you who are troubled, rest with us when the Lord Jesus shall be revealed from heaven with his mighty angel. In flaming fire, taking vengeance on them that know not God and that obey not the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ, who shall be punished with everlasting destruction from the presence of the Lord and from the glory of his power. When he shall come to be glorified in his saints and to be admired in all them that believe, because our testimony among you was believed in that day. Wherefore, also we pray always for you that our God would count you worthy of his calling and fulfill all the good pleasures of his goodness and the work of faith with power, that the name of our Lord Jesus Christ may be glorified in you and ye in him, according to the grace of our God and the Lord Jesus Christ. Blessed be the reading of the word. Amen. Amen. shall I not be ashamed when I have respect unto all thy commandments. Mm -hmm. I will praise thee with of righteousness of heart mm -hmm. when I shall have learned the righteous judgments. I will keep thy statutes. Oh, forsake me not. Mm -hmm. That'll be the reading. Amen. So, yes, so. Amen. Thereof 
go forth as brightness in the salvation thereof as a lamp that burneth. And the Gentiles shall see thy righteousness and all kings thy glory. And thou shalt be called by a new name which the mouth of the Lord shall name. Thou shalt also be a crown of glory in the hand of the Lord mm -hmm. and a royal diadem in the hand of thy God. Thou shalt no more be termed forsaken neither shall thy land any more be termed desolate. But thou shalt be called Hezbollah in thy land Beulah. For the Lord delighteth in thee, and thy land shall be married. For as a young man marrieth a virgin, so shall thy son marry thee. And as a bridegroom rejoice over his bride, so shall thy God rejoice over thee. I have set watchmen upon thy walls, O Jerusalem, which shall never hold their peace day nor night. Ye that make merry mention of the Lord, keep not silent, and give him no rest until he establish, until he make Jerusalem a praise in the earth. The Lord has sworn by his right hand, by the arm of his strength, surely I will no more give thy corn to be meat for thy enemies. Amen. And the sons of thy strangers shall not drink thy wine, for the which thou hast labored. But they that have gathered it shall eat it, and the praise of the Lord. And they that have brought it together shall drink it in the courts of my holiness. Go through, go through the gates, prepare ye the way of the people. Cast up, cast up the highway, gather up the stones, lift up a standard for the people. Behold, the Lord has proclaimed unto the end of the world, Say ye to the daughter of Zion, Behold, thy salvation cometh. Behold, his reward is with him, and his work before him. And they shall call them the holy people, the redeemed of the Lord. And thou shalt be called, sought out, a city not forsaken. Amen. 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 Amen.
turn your Bibles to the book of Philippians, chapter 3. The book of Philippians, chapter 3. Amen. Thank God for this beautiful day. Yes, yes sir. Hey, thank God for this day. Amen. Amen. What a joy it is to be in the house of God together. Amen. Yes, sir. Amen. Philippians chapter 3. We're going to begin reading with verse 7. Amen. Let's pray. Father God, we thank you. Thank you. We come before you in the name of Jesus. Yes. And Lord, we thank you. We praise you. Yes. Praise. We lift you up. We adore Lord. you. Yes. Praise your holy name. Lord. Thank you for your goodness. Yes. Thank you for your mercy. Yes. Thank you for your grace. Yes. Nothing like your grace. Yes. Without your grace, yes. we couldn't make it, Lord. Yes. We thank you for your grace. You. Now, Lord, we thank you for your word. Yes. Preach your word. Yes. Pour into our hearts and souls yes. your word. Yes. Holy Spirit, have your way. Yes. You know what we need. Yes. You know where we are, each one of us. Supply our needs yes. from the word of God. Yes. Have your way yes. in the name of Jesus. Yes. Amen. 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 The ultimate goal. The ultimate goal. Philippians chapter 3, beginning with verse 7. The ultimate goal. Paul says, but what things were gained to me? But what things were gained to me? These I have counted loss for Christ. Yet indeed I also count all things loss for the excellence of the knowledge of Christ Jesus, my Lord, for whom I have suffered the loss of all things, Listen to that, Paul. For whom I have suffered all things, amen, amen. and count them as rubbish. That word rubbish is garbage. And count them as garbage that I may gain Christ and be found in him not having my own righteousness which is from the law but that which is through faith in Christ, the righteousness which is from God by faith. Verse 10, that I may know him. That's it, church. That I may know him yeah. and the power of his resurrection mm. and the fellowship of his sufferings being conformed unto his death. If by any means I may obtain to the resurrection of the dead. Paul says, I want to know him. Talking about Christ Jesus. Yes, that I may know him. Amen. Amen. And if that's not enough, that I may know the power of his resurrection. Amen. Because Jesus got up, that means that we have power also yes. to walk in newness of life. Amen. Amen. And we're going to get up. Come on, give God a praise. Amen. We don't die. We just sleep in the Lord when God calls us home. That's from the power of Christ's resurrection. Look at verse 12. Paul says, not that I have already obtained or have already perfected. In other words, he's saying, I haven't arrived yet. I'm not perfect yet. <laughs> he says, but I press on yes. that I may lay hold yes. of that for which Christ Jesus has also laid hold of me. Amen. Verse 13. Brethren, I count, he says, I do not count myself to have apprehended. Amen. Brethren, sisters, I do not count myself to have apprehended. But one thing I do, listen to the church, this one thing that I focus on, 
One thing I do, what he says, forgetting those things which are behind. Amen. That's hard for us to do in the flesh. Amen. Sometimes we find our minds going back yes, sir. instead of going forward. Amen. Yes, Amen. Look what he says. He says, forgetting those things which are behind and reaching forward to those things which are here. Amen. I press toward the, the mark. The mark. Amen. 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 Church. I press toward the mark. You know when you're pressing, when you're pressing, you're leaning up against something and you're putting all of your weight on it. Yes. Right. Amen. Amen. Paul says, I press mm -hmm. toward the mark for, for the prize of the upward call of God in Christ Jesus. Yes. In other words, Christ is up. Mm -hmm. God is up. Mm -hmm. And he's going to call us home. He's going to call us up. Amen? Amen. Paul says, that's the one thing I focus on. That's right. And we must have the Holy Spirit to help us. Amen. Forgetting those things which are behind. Amen. And reaching forward for those things which are ahead. That's right. Look at verse 7 and verse 8. But what things were gained to me, these I have counted loss. The man could speak all kind of language. He was a Jew of Jew, mm -hmm. coming from the, the tribe of Benjamin. Amen. Mm -hmm. Paul says, I was a real Jew. I'm a real Jew, coming from the tribe of Benjamin. Mm -hmm. Had all kind of accolations and could speak all kind of different languages. But I count all of those things lost Amen. for the sake of knowing Christ. Mm -hmm. Come on, give God a praise. Amen. Amen. That should be our same attitude. Amen. 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 When it comes to knowing Christ, everything else becomes dim. Amen. Amen. For the sake of knowing Christ. Verse 8, he said, Yet indeed I also count all things for the excellency of the knowledge of Christ. Talking about knowing Christ, my Lord. For whom I have what? Suffered the loss of all, things. of all things. I put them behind me. All kind of degrees. I put them behind me. That's what you're saying. Those things don't matter. Mm -hmm. The thing that matter right now is us keeping our eyes on Jesus. Yeah. Come on, y'all. Yeah. Keeping our eyes on Jesus. Amen. That's the most important thing. Amen. Amen. Our families... It's good, amen. amen. We want to take care of them, amen. Right. Our children, our grandchildren, we think about them, amen. All, amen. All, the time, all the time, amen. But to know Christ, that's what's most important. Yes. To know him amen. and to get close to him. Yes. To be intimate in fellowship with him. Yes. Amen. amen. Think about a scripture in Revelation 3 and, 3 and 20. Jesus said, Behold, I come, I, I'm knocking on the door. Amen. And if any man would open the door and let me in, I would come in and sup with him. I would come in and fellowship with him. Amen. Amen. God wants to fellowship with us. And we all want to fellowship with him. Amen. That's what's most important. Amen. Money's not too important. Amen. Our bodies are important. But when it comes to knowing Christ, those things have to be secondary. Amen. 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 Verse 9, Paul says, and be found in him. <laughs> I don't want to be found in nowhere else. I don't want to be found in the casino. Amen. I don't want to be found in the lottery land. Come here with say amen. amen. I, I don't want to be found where I don't supposed to be. Amen. I want to be found in Christ. Amen. Come on, y'all. That's what it's all about. Amen. I want to be found mm -hmm. in Christ. Amen. Amen. In verse 10, in other words, I, I believe verse 10 should be the last verse. He says that I may know him. Mm -hmm. One translation says, I want to know him. Amen. Hey, I want to know him. Amen. 
Paul had been in the ministry now for 27 years, and he's still saying, I want to know him. The more we know about God, the more we need to know. Hey, amen. I want to know him. Number one. Number two, I want to know the power of his resurrection. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, Paul had a ministry, a ministry for the Gentiles. And that was, that was most important to him. I want to know the power of his resurrection. That's the gospel of Jesus Christ. How he died on the cross. Yes. How he suffered for us. How he laid in the tomb three days and three nights. And got up early Sunday morning. I want to know the power yeah. of his resurrection. Yeah. Praise God. Yeah. I want to know the fellowship yes. of sharing in his sufferings. This is the place where we lose a whole lot of people Glory. in the church. Amen? Amen. I want to know the fellowship of sharing in his suffering. Amen. We're not going to suffer like Christ suffered. But we do have to suffer sometimes. Amen. Jesus Amen. said, if any man will come after me, let him deny himself and take up his cross and follow me yes. daily. Yes, it is. When I say no to this flesh, I'm suffering. Glory. Amen. 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 When I deny my flesh of things that will hurt me, Amen. Yes. I'm suffering. Glory. Yes. Amen. It's nothing, it's not about, it's not about somebody taking our life or, or putting a gun to our head and all of that. No, no, no. When we deny ourselves, that's suffering. Amen. Amen. And we are doing it for the sake of Christ. Amen. Amen. I may know him. That I may know the fellowship of his resurrection. Amen. And of his suffering. Being conformed unto his death. Becoming like him. Amen. Looking like him. Walking in the nearness of life like him. Verse 12, that I have, he says, not that I have already obtained or am already perfect or perfected. I press on and I lay hold for that which Christ Jesus has laid hold of me. Amen. Amen. The ultimate goal in life for the believer is to know Christ. It says here that Christ Jesus has already died for my salvation. He has already laid hold of it. Now it becomes my responsibility to press on and to press on in my walk of faith to the finish line. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. That's all right. That's it. That's it, church. We got to go to the finish line. Amen. That's where the crown is. The crown of life. Amen. Amen. Jesus said in Revelation 2 and 20, Be thou faithful unto death, and I will give you a crown of life. Praise God. Amen. Amen. The Apostle Paul is sharing in his mindset. He's telling us his mindset, all of his accomplishment in the past. He accounted them lost for the sake of knowing Christ. When they are compared with knowing Christ, they are nothing. Amen. Amen. He wanted, the writer says, he wanted to be all Christ had in mind for him to be. He used up all of his energy in serving God. Amen. amen. From the example of this writer, amen, amen, we should not let anything distract us yes. from knowing Christ. Amen. 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 Nothing. Nothing. Amen. Not even my children. Amen. Not even my grandchildren. Amen. Not even money. Yeah, amen. Not even anything amen. should distract us from knowing Christ. Amen. Because when we stand before God, it's nobody else that will be standing there but us and God. Amen. amen. We're going to have to answer for our scepter. Amen. 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 Knowing Christ is the ultimate goal, amen? amen? We see here, the writer, we see his mindset. We see his attitude. Mm -hmm. Philippians 2 and 5, let this mind be in you, 
which was also in Christ Jesus. Amen. Amen. Paul had the mindset of Christ. Amen. Amen. Look at the mindset of the believer. Go to Hebrews chapter 12. Hallelujah. Hebrews chapter 12. It's a mindset. Think about Daniel, a young man about 17 years old. The Bible says he purposed in his heart not to eat the meat of the king. Amen. Amen. He purposed in his heart not to defile himself. Amen. And this is what we have to do. We have to purpose in our heart to walk with God. Glory. Not halfway, but walk with him all the way. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hebrews 12, verse 2, the writer says, Looking unto Jesus, who is the author and the finisher of our faith. Yes. Hey, who for the joy, come on church, yes, who for the joy that was set before him endured the cross. He did it with joy. Amen. If it had not been for the joy of the Lord, yes. he could not hang there. He could not die for the sins of the world. He could not become sin for us if it had not been for the joy of the Lord. Amen. The Bible says the joy of the Lord is our spirit. Amen. Come on, give God some praise. Amen. He did it with joy. Yes, my favorite verse. My favorite verse. Hebrews 12 and 3. First two verses. Consider him. Consider him. If you ever think about giving up, consider him. Amen. If you ever think about quitting, Amen. not coming no more, consider him. Amen. Hey, it's not about anybody else. Amen. It's only about you and God. Amen. Amen. Consider him. Amen. Oh, God, Amen. Consider him. Amen. Hey, consider him. Amen. 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 Consider him who endured such hostility from sinners against himself. Yeah. Lest you become weary and, and lest you become tired and give up. Amen. Yes, Consider him. Glory. Come on, give God some praise. Glory. If you don't consider nothing else, That's right. consider Christ what he went through. Yes. Amen. There's no way. Amen. It's no way praise. that you and I could bear what that man bears. Praise. Being spit on. Yes. Hey, mm -hmm. I don't know whether or not I could take it, church. Yes, sir. They whipped him. They beat him unmerciful yes, before he sir. got to the cross. Yes, His yes. own mother didn't recognize him. Praise Consider him what he went through. Yes. And these little trials that yes. we have, yes. don't you even think about giving up. Yes, yes, sir. Amen. Consider him. Hallelujah. We can't afford to look at the circumstances surrounding us. Praise if we do, we will stumble into the devil's trap. Praise we you. must always keep Jesus in sight. Yes. For he alone, I say for he alone, yes. will occur us. There is a light at the end of the tunnel. Hey, it might look dark today, Praise but there is a light at the end of the tunnel. If you stick with Jesus, he will show you that light. Yes. Praise yes. God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Last but not least, but there's always a bigger picture than what we can see with our physical eyes. Amen? Amen. Amen. Hey. Amen. One writer says, suffering is the training ground for the Christian maturity. Amen. Amen. I'm going to say it again. Suffering yes. is our training ground yes. Hey. Yes. for our maturity. Yes. Keep the faith. Amen. Go strong in the faith. Yes. Walk with God. Yes. Keep on walking with God. Yes. So, what do suffering do? It develops our patience. Yes. And I sure love that. Yes, sir. It develops our patience and makes our final victory sweet. Yes, sir. Sweet like Jesus. Amen. Yes, sir. Our final victory, yes, whether it's in a hospital bed, whether it's in bed at home, wherever it might be, yes. when that time comes, I want to rest in Jesus. Yes. Come on, give God some praise. Yes. And I don't know about you, but there's one thing I want to hear when I see his face. Well done. Well done. Well done. Somebody say well done. Well done. Praise God. Praise God. 
Hallelujah. I want to hear him say it. Thank God that you Well done, my faith. Yes, yes, sir. Yes. Sir. Yes. Thank God for Pastor Black. Yes. yes. Come on. want to do? I don't know. What do you want to do? Yeah. I don't know. What do you want to do? One, two, ready, go. Gonna pull the stops, gonna make it go. For anything that has to do with God to come under attack, you have to be under attack. Mm -hmm. But I have never known for a saint to lose one battle. Come on. Because we can hear God in all the punching. Without me, you can do nothing. nothing. And on the other side, yeah, but I can do all oh. thanks to Christ that what? That's the life we live. Amen. Amen. I'm glad for this ministry. Amen. Thank God. And it's making waves. It's making a whole lot of waves out there. People fight against it. How are you, you going to take a piece of cotton and break a piece of metal with it? <laughs> Up on this rock? Mm. Yes, sir. He did say it. Yes, he did. He did say it. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Jesus said it. Yes. Upon this word that I am. Yes. Yes, sir. I will build. Yes, sir. Whose church? His church. My church. Yes, sir. Yes. And God's word is true. True. Amen. Amen. I have no with it. And you shall know the truth. And the truth will 
make, make, make you free. You free. Amen. Yeah. So if, if you want to be free, yes. don't listen to me. Listen to the word of God. Amen. Here's this fellow John in 1 John 1. He started talking about that. Now that sets the subject. What is that that? We're going to get to it. John 1 and 1. That which was. Always was. Mm -hmm. From the beginning. Which we have heard. Look. Which we have seen. Mm -hmm. Now it's Jesus. Mm -hmm. With our eyes which we have looked upon, so yeah. look, look at it now. Mm -hmm. You see it with your eye, mm -hmm. and you look upon it. Mm -hmm. You take part of what you see. Mm -hmm. That's what it amounts to. The things which we have heard, you heard the word, mm -hmm. which we have seen, the Lord Jesus, with the eyes of our faith, which we have looked upon with our obedience toward it, mm -hmm. and our hands have handled of the word of life. That book you got in your hand is called the word of life. What? Mm -hmm. It's the word of life. Amen. Amen. And what I love about it, <coughs> the older I get, the sweeter Jesus seems to be. 1 John 1, 3. For the life was manifested. Jesus came, living. And we have seen the life in Christ Jesus. And bear witness. And show unto you that eternal life. Which was with the Father. Jesus was with the Father. And was manifested to us in the flesh. That which we have seen and heard, mm -hmm. preach we unto you, for what reason? That you also may have fellowship with us. And truly, our fellowship mm -hmm. is with the Father and with his Son, Jesus. Mm -hmm. This is what the Word will do for you. 1 John 1 and 4. And these things write we unto you, look, look, that your joy mm -hmm. may be full. Yes, sir. Now the word of God that came from the Son of God manifested you by the Holy Spirit is come that your joy might be full. Uh -huh. Now anything else from any other source came to rob you of your joy. Amen. Because the joy of the Lord is what? Strength. Our strength. Yes, sir. That's not something we read, man. Mm -hmm. In the beginning was the word, the word was with God, the word was God. Uh, this is God laid down flat. Believe him and he'll stand up for you. Amen. Fight your battles. Amen. Amen. Give you a good night, sweet sleep. Amen. Are you listening to me? Never mind what folks say and ain't doing, doing, ain't doing, right. accusing, ain't accusing. No, no. If you stay your mind on Christ. Amen. Yeah. Amen. That's my heart. He will give you sweet peace. Yeah. Not, not just peace. Sweet peace. Yeah. 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 But look at the condition. You got to stay your mind on him. Yes. Don't think about circumstances, situation, relationship, husband, wife. Pit bull, huh? Secretary of State, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Amen. God will keep him in perfect peace. Yes, sir. Yes. That's the word. But, but look what it say now. He that keeps his mind on what? Jesus. Jesus. You got to think on Jesus. Yes. God showed me one time I had a balloon. Blew that balloon up. Pull it underneath water. Every time I turn that balloon loose, 
it'll pop up because it's full of something. It is. It's full of the air that came out of me. Yes. Jesus came out of God. Yes, sir. And if you fill with him, he nobody can bring you down. Amen. Are you listening to me? Yeah. This is real gospel here. Amen. This is real gospel. Amen. And keep in mind, now, it ain't not in the street somewhere. This Bible that you love so much. So your worst foes. Uh-huh. Oh, boy, boy. Uh-huh. Those that carry your name. Somebody in, in, in the street hurt you a little taste, that, that, that hurt a little bit. But when that person you gave birth to, and that person you fell in love with, uh -huh. Amen. Come on. they hurt you from the inside. Amen. Amen. But, but I know a you. Yeah. 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 I, I know a you. Yeah. See, if you get hurt, go to the doctor with it. Dr. Jesus. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You, you, you ain't got to, he, he'll, he'll write you a prescription before you tell him what the problem is. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Amen. Now, let me show you what that prescription is before you start shouting at him. That prescription that will do away with your hurt is forgiveness for the one that hurt you. Mm -hmm. Amen. Oh, you ain't going to say nothing about that. Amen. Yes, sir. Jesus, I forgive you uh -huh. because you're crucifying me because you don't know who I am. People don't know who you are. Amen. They don't know who you are. And before we got saved, we didn't know who we are, where we were going, what we going to get when we get there. Uh -huh. Amen. Uh -huh. But in the sunshine time in diverse matters, yeah. Yeah. God said, Jesus, come on. Hey, I said, hey, man, hey. And, and he came and he exposed himself to us. Amen. He didn't come to us. He said, come unto me. Me. Wherever you are. Mm -hmm. No matter what sin you committed. Amen. No matter how much darkness between you and me. Yeah. See, see, I don't care how much darkness you got. If you light a match, mm. you can see that match. Yep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Glory. And Jesus saw that the whole world was in darkness. So he wrote in his word in John 3, 16, God so loved, what? World. The world, uh -huh. man. Uh -huh. The world. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. mm. He did something about it. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. He put flesh around himself. Uh -huh. Yes, yes. And when we see him, we call him Jesus. When we receive him, they call him Christ. Yes. See, Jesus can't come into your heart. Glory. He's a piece of flesh. That's right. But I'm going to go that said, uh, whosoever shall come. Jesus. Uh, yeah. who, did you see how big that thing is? Yes. Now that whosoever can be that person that dogged you, uh -huh. stomped you, yeah. lied on you, yeah. gossip about you. Yeah. He's got a soul. Yes. And God said, Oh, so I have sent to him. Uh -huh. Oh, so I uh have -huh. uh -huh. belong to me. Yeah. Yeah. He ain't through. But that soul that sinned. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Yes, sir. And uh -huh. don't confess. Uh -huh. Go burn in hell forever. Amen. But you see, every time, every time God show you hell, mm -hmm. He show you heaven. Mm -hmm. He came to bring heaven down and Fill your heart with the goodness of God. You, you need to get this plain gospel. If it ain't right, what? Wrong. Yeah. Yes, sir. That's right. <laughs> now, don't expect for the devil to shout on this kind of stuff. Amen. I, I just had a vision. You know, you, you putting the devil's hand to a blowtorch. He ain't more than your hand. <laughs> well, hell is a thousand times harder. Torch will eventually burn out. But hell, God said, mm. will burn forever oh, and ever and ever. Yeah. That ain't where we want our souls to go. Well, that ain't where I want mine to go. Yeah. And then when he start describing.
in heaven is peace and love and joy and comfort and long suffering and mercy endure forever. That, that ain't here. You, you ain't gonna get all of that here. No. You, some, and when you taste it, you wanna shout and speak in tongues and run. You, you ain't there yet. That's right. That's right. But you can, you can sit here and look yonder. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Now, I, I'm not telling you what you can do. I'm telling you what I've done. I have seen God sitting on this throne. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And the light is so bright you need two story glasses to see it. Shades. The sight of God is beyond human perception. He is glorious. Amen. Yes. He is what they call mock the What the German call mock the mm. The Spanish say mucho bueno. Yes, sir. English, good. Plain old, good. Amen. This plain old, good. Have you seen Jesus today? And they know. Hold your Bible up. Glory. Say, yeah, Rev. Yes, Rev. He is here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> now, now, now. Jesus said out of his own mouth, yeah. I will never. <laughs> <laughs> now, that never means ain't no end to it. We'll just keep on doing it. Yes, thank I will you. never. Oh, what's it today? Thank I will you. never leave you. Looks yes. like that would be enough, but he said, and I won't forsake you either. Yes, yes, yes. Uh -huh. It looked like to me he didn't have to say I won't forsake you, but I'm going to let him say if he want to say, I will never leave you, no. nor no. forsake you. He mm. kept on saying that good stuff, even to the world. Yes. End of the world, I'll yes. be with you yes. no matter what. Yes. Glory yes. to you. Yes. And when you get married, boy, I, I was bragging the other day, you know, when I, I was out at the Salvation Army, you know, buying a picture of a glass so my wife was looking at and see how pretty she was. <laughs> and the man at the cash register, he's a sanctified man. Uh -huh. He said, you, you could have bought this mirror anywhere, couldn't you? I said, yeah, I came for you to talk to me about how good God is. He said, stand over there a minute. Whenever you get ready to talk about how good God is, the devil will send somebody sure to up. interrupt. Yes, Amen. Amen. The line at the cash register got yes. long. Mm -hmm. I just went on there and waited. Mm -hmm. See, when you sweetly say, can't nobody tell you what you don't already know. Amen. Amen. But somehow or other, when somebody tell you, child, you know God show is a what? Good God. You've been knowing it all the time, but you give witness to it. Yes, My soul yes. said yes. 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 My soul shout for joy just to hear the name of Jesus. Yes, yes Lord. So now, now this is, see, this is, this is saint to saint talking now. This ain't, this ain't saint to sinner talking. Oh, look how personal it is. Oh, how I love, love Jesus. Love who? Jesus. Now you got to set that in order now. Not that I love him, but he loved me. 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 And we got to take that thing off of Jesus. He's the best thing. No, he ain't no thing. <laughs> He's King of Kings, mm. Lord Pray. of Lords, the Lamb of mm. God, mm. the Prince of Peace, yes. the Messiah. Yes. <laughs> when you said Jesus, man, all heaven glory yes. right now. Yes. He's the man in heaven. Yes. Oh, he's the man in heaven. Yes. And 
see, 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 we, we like to think that he coming down. No, no, he, 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 he went to heaven as Jesus and came back as the Holy Ghost. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. so she said, I would not leave you comfortless. I will come to you. Yeah. yeah. That is, I am what I am. Yeah. The spirit of the living God. You. Thank God for Pastor Black. He don't teach nothing but that word. Boy, oh, that word, that word. Bless my heart. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. Sister Rio, my only pastor, says, stand up, strike fire, and sit down. <laughs> there been some fire struck here today. Amen. 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 So we got a notice the choir can't sing because so and so so and so so and so. I, I said, you, you just go ahead and sing, I'll cut the TV off. Mm -hmm. And they so do boy. Yes, sir. How come? That's that calling. That's that calling, man. Yes. I'm a pastor. Thursday, the snow was up to here. I didn't expect for none of y'all to come. But I heard a statement. Be ye faithful. Amen. Yes, sir. I put on my boots. Hey, I put on my boots. Mm -hmm. And I came here and cut all the heat up as if you're going to come. I didn't want you to come. I just prepared as if you were. And quarter after seven, when I got ready to leave, here come Billy. <laughs> I had to stop to get me some gas. I had to pick up my son. I'm sorry I'm late. Let's pray. Boy, we church of God. We church of God. Yes, sir. Here is a good way to church of God. Yes. Not with your prayer requests. Amen. 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 This is scripture now. Come into my courts with praise. Yes. yes. Mm -hmm. Amen. Huh? Amen. Touch his heart with Lord, I thank you. Amen. Lord, I love you. Amen. Lord, I magnify you. Yes. Lord, you've been good to me. Yes. Tell him all the stuff he already know. Yes. How come? Because we overcome by the word of our word. Just to want to tell God how good he is. Yes, sir. Proclaim the goodness of God. Now, I know you think we're just talking about the church. No. No, we don't have to proclaim the goodness of God here because we're all represented. Mm -hmm. It's when we leave here mm -hmm. and go where somebody is that don't know God right. but claim to know God. Mm -hmm. I keep hearing scripture. Let your light so shine. Yeah. <laughs> that men will see your what? Good works and what? Glory of the Father, which is in them. So what give God glory? Your good works. Yes. Not your good words. Your life mm -hmm. shows the blessings of God. Now, when you're going to show God with your life, come on here. You're going to have to go through some things and tell them. You know what tell them mean? Yeah. <laughs> one thing a tell Amen. That's what my grandma used to say. Boy, if it ain't one thing a tell <laughs> Every time I look around, you're in trouble. Hey, if it ain't but one thing to tell you, you're always in trouble. Come here, boy. Go get that tree and pull it up. I said, oh, Lord. <laughs> Not with the tree. <laughs> <laughs> and then she tell you stuff. You know, it don't make no sense. We had them overhaul with the buttons on the side and the back. Yep. <laughs> the worst thing I've ever heard is, let me see it. Lord, have mercy on us. And I start singing that song, if I ever need it. <laughs> if I ever need it, Lord, I sure need it now. <laughs> and I'm going to tell you what you don't know because you didn't come down south. He said, boy, I'm going to beat you. So sons of so and so going to kill you. Yeah. Amen. Amen. I had a temple <clears throat> and I didn't have the temple table. So 
so I know what it is to be covered with prayer. Amen. To be covered with prayer like that. Yeah. Ain't worth a quarrel. Yeah. Amen. Now, that was before I got saved. So I'm not covered with prayer no more. I'm covered with grace. Yeah. Amen. 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 And, and, I, and I heard God say, my grace what, 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 what? Yes, sir. It's good enough for you. Yes, sir. Never mind the circumstances. Mm -hmm. Never mind all of that stuff. God's grace will never fail. God's grace is the sealing power of his word. Amen. Mm -hmm. That's why you can say only by the word, grace of God, I am we really ain't about nothing. Amen. You see the noise that might take when I lay something on it? Mm -hmm. Anytime somebody lays something on it. I'm saved and sanctified and filled with the Holy Spirit. What do you mean? Ay, 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 ay. Go get saved. When you when God moved that thing, what do you hear now? Nothing. In the still and the quietness of the night. Amen. When there ain't nobody awake but children. Yeah. Some of you people live by yourself, you know what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. You can reach out and touch God. Yes, sir. <clears throat> That's a privilege. Amen. Yes, yes. That's a privilege. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Why? Because he first loved me when I was a blood. If I sin, I'm no more lovely. Mm -hmm. But that don't change God's love. And God so loved the world, world that he gave his son Jesus. Mm -hmm. Look at the vasticity of it. That whosoever. Yeah. Now we need to look at that word. Whosoever. That means that one that just curse you out. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The one ought to come to you when they need money. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. He got a soul. Mm -hmm. And God said, all souls are what? Mine. 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 But the soul, <laughs> here's it, here come the necessity. This is necessitating Jesus. But the soul that sin must surely die. Mm -hmm. Jesus said, I am come. Yeah. That you might have what? Uh, life. 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 Yeah. life. Yeah. Yeah. And that you might have it more yeah. boastfully. Yeah. Child of God, I wash my robes in the cleansing fountain. I am a child. Oh God. You see, it is a normal thing for word teaching ministry to come under attack. Amen. But you have never seen sin that took Jesus to hell. And he didn't come up. Amen. Nothing is too hard for God. Oh God. Amen. Now the scripture said, cast all your care. Mm -hmm. Cast. Mm -hmm. Cast all your care mm -hmm. upon him. Now step, that's Jesus. Cast all your care upon him. Look at it now. He care for you. What is that care? Whatever care is. Amen. If you're a sinner, cast it on Jesus. He died to give it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. If you don't got no money, mm -hmm. get you a job. Mm -hmm. Go borrow your lawn mow. Amen. Amen. Go borrow your shell. Yeah. Amen. Earn your living by the sweat of your right. faith. You see, see you, you can't make God a lie not trying to make him good. Yeah. I, I 
I tell you again, when I, when I, when I first get, so I come in the church, and they take the offering, I put my hand down in the offering plate. Nothing in my hand. Then I raised up, so they let me know I didn't take nothing out of there. I did that for two or three weeks. Mm -hmm. After that, I was the biggest tithe in the church of God. God gave me a job. Mm -hmm. As an electrician in Chile, snow, sleep, rain. Amen. And God gave me the strength to go to that job. Amen. Amen. Now, this is my job. Pastor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And let me tell you something. It is a privilege yeah. to sit here and tell you what you already know. you're going to right now and he stopped your direction toward hell mm -hmm. on my way well on my way to hell uh -huh. I said Lord if there's a savior anywhere mm -hmm. oh God I had a hard time man I had a hard time mm -hmm. I had a hard time I had a fighting spirit didn't weigh 140 pounds light as a fella going beat a boy 250 pounds. <laughs> Anger was a care I had because I didn't have the one to mm -hmm. take the anger away. Mm -hmm. Anger was a child of sin. Mm -hmm. So if you're going to move anger, you got to get rid of what? Sin. Sin is the devil's workshop. Mm -hmm. Yes, he is. Hallelujah. Now, 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 now don't, don't, don't misuse grace too much now. Because if somebody just keep on joking at you, the more they joke, you better pray. Amen. Amen. Don't worry about nothing. Amen. Amen. That's where you get that word only. Amen. You, you are messed up. Amen. 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 And, then, and then here comes Jesus. And you try to hide from him. And I, I try to lie to him. Well, I did that because he did that. <laughs> Jesus said, Have they ever hung you on a cross? Amen. Have they ever beat you beyond recognition? Mm. Have you ever been to hell three days and three nights and mm. took the power of sin and Who do you think you are? Amen. God Amen. will put 
put you in your place. Amen. Amen. So that we can come up with this statement only. St. John 3.16. All those books, man. All those books. God so made mm. love the world so much. Mm. He had to take Jesus as the payment for the sin mm. that the world was in. Amen. And if he had crucified me for my sin, there would be no benefit. So God took Jesus and allowed his enemies to beat him beyond recognition and then hang him on a cross and beat him like he was a fellow. It was nothing. But they could only do that to fulfill scripture. Three days. And at the end of that third day, he was what the devil never want to hear. I'm up. Mm. And all power mm. is to kill the power of hell. So he named the other two places. And all the power of heaven and earth is seen in my nail prints mm. in my hand. When there's a problem, first give yourself to Jesus. Amen. Just like you are. He, he know you're gonna ask him to solve the problem, but you got to do all things decently. What? Amen. And in order. Lord, heal me just like a man. Yes. Uh, nevertheless, Lord, uh, have you seen this? He, he waited. Because he gave us the invitation, cast all your care upon me. Now look what he said. I would care for you. Now look at that, saints. Jesus is the best thing that heaven ever had. And if he said, I care for you, what are you thinking that other way? He ain't up with me about nothing. They didn't give you life. They might take it. Yeah. Might steal from you. Mistreat you. Beat you up. Neglect you. Leave you. Lie on you. Mm -hmm. So you take all the attributes mm -hmm. of the world and stand them up against the promises of God. <coughs> Paul said, all have forsaken me. Every single one. I read that up. He said, but nevertheless, God. <laughs> God. Yes. Stood with me. And, and here we are. We can say the same thing and, and attach something to it. I will never leave you. An offer Savior. How long, Jesus? Even to the end of time, I will never leave you. I'm doing this so you relax. I'm trying to see how much time I got. I got 31 minutes. See, if you got something else to do, you got a job, you got some else to take care of, that's your big Go take care of your business. Amen. But you prioritize and put God what? Face. He understands. We ain't about nothing. <laughs> and see, we say, 
when people live, when people leave, take Jesus, what? With you. What? All the way. All the way from earth to glory. 30 minutes now. 1 John 1. I, I got all of this, you know. But I don't think you're going to stay here for me to teach all this. You might want to stay, but you might get hungry. 1 John 1. Look at it now. The time element comes in. That which was God from the beginning. In the beginning was the word, the word was with God, the word was God. <clears throat> which we have heard, the word of God. Which we have seen, the Son of God, mm -hmm. with our eyes. Which we have looked upon with the faith of our soul. And our hands have handled the word of God. For the life was manifested, look, and we have seen it and bear witness and show unto you that eternal life which was with the Father and was manifest to us through his Son. 1 John 1, 3. That which we have seen, he's going to repeat himself, see, and heard the word of God, declare we unto you, we saw God, we heard God, we're going to preach God to you. We're going to say to you what God said to me to say to you. It's called preaching the gospel. Mm -hmm. That you also may have fellowship with us. The gospel makes us have spiritual fellowship with one another. I didn't say the gospel. I said the gospel mm -hmm. make us one with one another. Because Jesus ain't got but one body. <clears throat> and truly, our fellowship is with the Father and with his Son, Jesus Christ. And these things write we unto you, look, read it, that your joy may be full. May be full. Glory. Amen. So, so what makes your joy full? The word of God Amen. give you the joy. This then is the message. Now everything from 1 John 1 and 4 was what's supposed to come. The fifth verse is going to tell you what the message is. 1 John 1 and 5. This then is the message which we have heard of Jesus and preach or declare unto you. Here's the message. That God is what? Light. light and in him is no darkness at all total holiness that's my subject sin free living God is love Amen. holiness that's what this Bible teach 1 John 1 and 6 if we say that we have fellowship with him help me with it and walk in darkness, reading. We lie and, and do, do not the truth. You say you saved and still got sin, you're a lie. Uh -huh. I didn't say it already. Amen. So you say you're holy and ain't holy. That's a bad place to be. So God sent Jesus to get us from that bad place uh -huh. to a good place inside the church of the living. 1 John 1, 7. But if we walk in the light, as he is in the light, uh -huh. if we walk in the light that God is, that Jesus walked within, we have, look, fellowship. Uh -huh. Look, one with another. Look at the benefit. And the blood. Oh, the blood. And the blood of Jesus Christ, his son, read it, cleansed us from what? All, All sins. Saints don't have sin. That's a lie. Amen. 
my phone number, 810-423-2433. I didn't say it. I read it out of God's word. Amen. Mm -hmm. And anybody that teach this is teaching you a lie. The word of God is truth. Receive it, it will save your soul. Come on here. Now I had to go through these steps, so I know it's necessary. I had to tell God. He already knew I'm a sinner. I said, Lord, see, when you get ready to confess something that's not like God, you get all of God's attention. Amen. Oh, no, I, sh I shouldn't have said it like that. I, I, could, I could have said the same thing, but I had the wrong spirit on it. You, you got to confess it and keep you out of heaven. Amen. I, I, I heard this song. Jesus came down and glory. <laughs> you see, feel my soul. He took my sins away and turned my midnight. <laughs> See, people were writing songs. They just trying to make songs, write songs to make money now. Mm -hmm. But in the olden time, yes. people heard God. And songs like that don't come from the head of a man. It comes to the heart of a man. Now, God's job is to teach you to listen to Jesus. Jesus' job is to teach you to hear the Holy Spirit that going to tell you about the Father. So God the Son and God the Holy Ghost preach God the Father. Are y'all out there? Amen. And you'll see it in Genesis 1.1. In the beginning was it? Word. And what was it? God. What was? God. So this book teach you God. Teach you all about water. I can smell it for you. I can spell it for you. I can wash you with it. But until you get it in your mouth, you're gonna die. You got to get the truth down into your inner man. His name is Soul. When I was down south, I played in the band. We didn't love Jesus, and we called it the Soul Train. The devil, he is a good imitator mm -hmm. of God. So, right, so somebody told me about so and so and so and so, and that person is 80 years old. And I'm Pastor, you hear me now, hear me now. I, come, I couldn't come because she, I couldn't stand to see her in that bed. And look at me. I saw God say, I didn't say you were lying, the truth ain't in you. I just didn't receive Amen. what you were saying. Mm -hmm. Amen. The woman been to Africa. She been in Jamaica. She been to Spain. She been to Korea. Mm -hmm. She's 80 years old now. It ain't time for her to go on an evangelistic field now. Amen. Here's what God tell us old folks. You've been faithful. You go higher, sit to the end. You ain't been a whole lot of faithful. You've been faithful just a few things. Yeah, yeah. I'm standing outside the door of heaven now, uh -huh. listening to God. Uh -huh. And he's going to say, come on in. Lord, have mercy on your son. Did you know the apostles are going to judge the angels? It's in God's word. We are the apostles of God. We take the word of God and lay it against the works of God and see that it's the same thing. And if whatever is not like God is sin. All unrighteousness is what? Sin. Mm -hmm. 
So God sent Jesus to wash all that sin away that our body might be the temple mm -hmm. of the Holy Spirit. Yeah. So the Holy Spirit job is to live within us yeah. and keep flesh dead. Amen. Mm -hmm. Now that's a job. And we can't do it. Amen. Only by grace. grace of God. Only. Two months, I'll be 86 years old. I don't feel like it. How come? I got me a young God. So I put my license somewhere and I couldn't find them, so I thought I'd lost them. And so I went back down to wherever you get your license from. He said, how old are you? I said, hey. I said, almost 86. Look what they said. And still driving? I said, what do you think I come to get the license for? <laughs> Listen to me. Don't expect for the world to see. They can't see that. They can't see that. They can't see it. See, we understand through faith. We don't understand with our head. We understand with our heart. Now, I don't understand what it means in the beginning, God. But I know what now. I know it was before time because he would have wrote at the beginning. So at 86, I'm trying to figure out, Lord, thy will be done at time, any time you get me in. Amen. Look what this word say now. And I got 18 minutes. Trust in the Lord. Lord, don't estimate this church. Trust in the mm -hmm. Lord with all your what? Heart. Heart. Mm -hmm. Lean not to your oh, understanding. And all of your ways. Not, what? It's not, not as God. And what will he do? Healing. He will direct your path. Thank you, Lord. I trust. I trust God. I trust God. I trust Amen. God. Yeah. Thank you. So I asked Paul, how long am I? Supposed to teach it. She said, I'm with you. I said, all right, I'll, I'll do my two hours. <laughs> then when I leave here, I'm going to take Pastor Blackman to dinner. Amen. Knowing that my wife is expecting me. But I saw a word in here, fellow Jesus. 
Jesus touched it, mm. he looked up. Mm -hmm. It just got multiplied. Mm -hmm. Because Jesus said, without my father, I can't. I can't do nothing. Mm -hmm. So looking up is asking for help. Mm. Try something. You can act like Jesus. Amen. You live like Jesus. Amen. You got the same father as Jesus. Amen. You got the same problem as Jesus. Amen. There ain't nobody in here that don't got a family problem. Amen. Amen. Right. Amen. All right. But yeah. a family problem is just one thing. Jesus said, cast all hmm. your care. Amen. He didn't get it. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Then they gave you the problem. I care. Mm. Don't worry about your children. You can love them. They really don't belong to you. Amen. And we need to do this, Bible man. I, I hear you telling me nothing is too much. Nothing. The scripture say, all right, then cast it. Mm -hmm. Expect for him to solve it. You and I can't solve now kind of problem. We will make things worse. Amen. Mm -hmm. That's true. Amen. We are problem makers. Yes, sir. Amen. Only, only Jesus is problem solved. Yeah. So this Bible says, now you listen, because you've been saying it all the time. Cast all. Don't leave it out there. You know, when, when Jesus said, kill the goat, the sheep, and the ass, and the oxen, and everything. And he said, have you killed all of them? And the goat said, bah. <laughs> he said, I thought. They lied to Jesus. We save the best yes. to sacrifice. Mm -hmm. Jesus said, obedience is better. Amen. Ah, than sacrifice. I think that's a picture now. That's a picture now. You, you see this thing, look like you can have it. No, you can't. You can't make God no lie. He said, cast all. Yeah. That means every single one yeah. of your cares over me. Mm -hmm. look, look, he signed it with a signature. Yeah. I, yeah. <laughs> my subject, yeah. I care for you. Yeah. Now the devil can't do nothing about that. I was here Thursday. That snow was knee high to a giraffe. But see, I only lived five doors down there. Mm -hmm. And I got some big old leather boots, you see. And I came here. I didn't expect you to come. But I didn't expect for you to be a pastor. Tell me, be faithful to the snow. Hey. I ain't dead yet. Mm -hmm. Tell you about the sentence of one, and we're going to spend these last 11 minutes. First word in Genesis 1 1. I tried to make it act. Mm -hmm. 
before there was a beginning of anything. In the beginning that God is, <clears throat> God created the heaven and the earth. Look now and learn. There ain't no S on heavens. There ain't no S on earth. How come? Is in process now. In the beginning when there was nothing, God took nothing and created heaven. Where was he when he was creating? Nowhere. Amen. Well, now, now you deal with that. Amen. So God that's nowhere created somewhere and called it his living place, home that's too small for him. Because God so loved the world. That's bigger than heaven. You can, you can count the number of angels in heaven. I've seen that number of them. In the beginning, God, here's the secret to your deliverance, created. Now, he created everything. Yes. Then he created man last. Now, I heard on television somewhere told that they found out that a man came from an amoeba mm -hmm. or some kind of bug. I said, okay, okay. Then they come and ask me, I said, where did the amoeba come from? Amen. Where did the bug Amen. come from? Amen. My words say in the beginning, God mm -hmm. yes. created. Amen. You better let you better let God be true in every man alive. That's right. Amen. Yeah. Amen. You shall know the truth, and that truth shall make you free. Yeah. Yeah. Free at last. Free at last. What's the next word? Thank, Thank God, God Almighty. Almighty. I am free. Uh -huh. wow. Come on. Come on, y'all. Yeah. It seems like it's a song. No, that's the Bible. And when you see Jesus, amen. 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 When I see the man that died for me, yeah. hey. Yeah. people out there with them 99 doctor's degrees. To new Bibles of Genesis 1, 1 and explain to me the first four words. In the beginning, God. Uh -huh. Now, there was nothing. Right. And everything that we understand, see, or look at mm -hmm. was created. So there was no place for God. Amen. So when our souls get to heaven, heaven ain't going to be big enough, so we're going to go in and out of there faster. Huh? Amen. Heaven ain't big enough for all the souls that God is going to call to you. Amen. Amen. I don't know what that means either. You're going to go in and out of there faster. Pastor may go eat something. Huh? Amen. So don't say heaven came down and glory filled my soul. I ain't think about heaven going down. I'm thinking about me going up. Amen. <clears throat> Got six minutes. In the name of Jesus, the mighty name Amen. of Jesus, we have the victory. In the name of Jesus. The mighty name of Jesus. 
Satan, you have to flee. Yeah. Oh, well, who can stand before us when we call on Your that great name? Great name? <laughs> Jesus, 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 we have the victory. Now, come on. Now, when I, when I go out and sing to my wife, we have the victory. She said, re, 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 re. <laughs> we got the victory. Here are some big words to God. Be the glory. Look, for all the things that he has done, Children, 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 thank God mm. for all He has done for me. For me, I got four minutes. Hallelujah. I'll read to you Genesis 1 and 1. In the beginning, mm -hmm. God, He did so, created the heaven. There was no heaven until God created it. And he created the earth. Mm -hmm. And the earth was without form. Amen. Now deal with that. Mm -hmm. How the earth, uh, how are you going to be without form? Don't know. God said it. I believe it. That's right. Amen. And the earth was without form. And void, which means nothing was on it, nobody was on it, because it didn't exist at all. And darkness. Was. And, and darkness was upon the face of the deep. That's the ocean and the sea. Because there wasn't no sun. Are y'all listening to me? There wasn't no S-U-N. And there wasn't no S-O-N. So God created everything in dark. Mm -hmm. And the spirit, whew, hey, the Holy Ghost yeah. moved yeah. up on the face of the waters mm -hmm. to tell the waters, go right there yes, sir. and don't go no further. Did you know three quarters of the earth is nothing but water? Amen. God control that water. Don't move. Amen. And when a storm comes, come up and go back. Amen. Lord have mercy. If God can control the water, Amen. Amen. Hey, he can control. Amen. Listen now, there ain't no devil. Ain't no devil. That's a heaven. Mm -hmm. And God didn't create no devil. Mm. The devil created himself by trying to be, I'm going to be like God. What? Amen. Amen. And I, I'm seeing God already making a plan before he made the angel, you see. And he said, one of them going to go bad and try to act like he be. Mm -hmm. But I'm going to tell Michael, uh, get, get your sewing ready. Mm -hmm. That devil, he ain't gonna drag it with no tail. No, that devil persuaded mm -hmm. one third of yes. all the angels that God had created, yes. millions of them. Yes. And the devil tricked them. Listen to me now. By making them think that he was God. So you got a statement now. Mm -hmm. Cast all your care. Yeah. What? Oh, oh God. Don't yeah. let the devil trick you. Yeah. Don't let the devil. Amen. Don't let the devil trick you. Amen. Don't let the devil trick you. Here when 
I start this ministry, I'll be teaching you till five or six o'clock. One woman, my first secretary, Sister Gillian, she was one of those. And people try to tell me it don't take all of that. Yes, it does. Then they try to tell me, oh, Europe wasn't built in one day. I ain't building on Europe. <laughs> I'm working inside the kingdom. Yeah. The kingdom of God is righteousness and peace. What? And joy and the Holy Ghost. Yeah. That's a good place to be. Yeah. So in my closing, There's a whole lot in this book. Amen. And just when I think we got it all, oh, 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 boom, here come on, Amen. Father, we're thankful. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your love. Yes. And your kind. Yes. And your tender blessing. Yes, Lord. Yes. Thank you for your faith. Yes. Your long suffering yes. with us. Gave us your son. Yes, thank you. He gave us your spirit. Yes, thank you, God. And we worship you. Yes. In the spirit and the beauty of holiness. Yes, yes. Lord. Go on with us. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Keep us safe. Yes, Lord. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Help us to maintain the joy. Mm. Yes, help us, Lord. For you say the joy of the Lord. Is our strength. So keep us strong. Yes, Lord. Help us to forgive the one that refused to forgive us. Yes, mm -hmm. help us, Lord. You're big enough to do it. Yes. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Thank God for Jesus. Thank God for Jesus. Amen. 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 I heard God say, Bring. did not say past the offering plate. He said, bring it. So the offering plate is somewhere, Tuggle. Bring the offering plate and See, it takes an effort to bring something to God. So come and give God. 